What's going on YouTube? This is King Karate Chop back to finally continue this Royal Rumble tournament. And today we have some very interesting characters. Here we go. Who's going to start us off at number one? Donald Duck. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be a Disney Royal Rumble. We're probably going to see some superheroes, maybe some Star Wars characters. Now that Disney owns both of those. Donald Duck is here and he is ready to fight, but it looks like somebody else is coming out. It's looking kind of scary. Oh, it's Darth Vader! And from I suggest he puts that mask back on, yeah, though, if, if you ask me. <laughs> here we go! Here we go. Royal we are Rumble ready to start this Royal Rumble. Here. I don't think there's a more dramatic match in Looks all like Darth Vader is just already Royal taking Rumble. it to Donald Duck. I really don't think Donald stands a chance here. Uh-oh. Okay, maybe I spoke a little too soon. Oh, nope. He tried to get a little bit of offense in there, but Darth Vader shut that down real quick. And actually, he did put that mask back on, that helmet. So, good for him. He'll be able to last a little bit longer. Who's going to come out number three? Drax. Drax the Destroyer is here. This guy at number three. To make major impact here. Now he yeah, could go toe-to-toe -to -toe to with Darth Vader. Here They're going to team up on the smaller Ryan, guy and Donald Duck. Looks like he's already going to exit this match. Could be trouble here, guys. Now they're teaming up Look again. Oh yeah, Donald Duck is toast. Up. There he oh, goes. Oh, they made duck soup out, out of him. Now they're going to stare each other down and Darth Vader gets the first hit. Coming in at number four is Woody. This ring ain't big enough for the three of them. Harsh impact. What's Woody going to do? It looks like he's just going to let them fight it out first. Oh, here he goes. Is he going to throw a drag? Okay, no. you got to believe this one's over. Darth Vader kind of celebrating there, but he's got a long way to go if he wants to celebrate. He did start the match, so. Oh! Oh! That was nice. Number five is Iron Man. This could be a game changer, Michael. There's some good competition in the ring right now. I'm not sure about Woody, but. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. Uh oh. Okay, yeah, Darth Vader's going to just At least go over there anyway. and try to hey, pummel him. Iron Man's got a hold of Drax. Is Drax gone? Can Drax hang on? I think a lot of people right now are scratching their heads. Woody's actually got the upper hand on Darth Vader, and of course, as soon as I say that, Darth Vader just. Oh, okay. No. Woody's fighting back again. He just took down Darth Vader. Number six is Groot. Okay, are we actually going to see some synergy between Groot and Drax the Destroyer? Maybe they'll team up. That could have been disastrous. I tell you what, he's got a good size on him, so he should be able to stand tall with Darth Vader. And he's going right after Drax. Is he taking him out? Drax is going to keep fighting. Iron Man's going to help. There goes Drax. Woody just gets tossed. Uh oh, is it gone? Who is next? A fresh superstar usually does, Cole. If I was actually Pooh, I'd probably run the other way. I don't. <laughs> I don't know about. Oh, there goes Woody. I don't know if Pooh's going to be able to do much, but well, is he going to take out Darth Vader? He might have. Ooh, oh! Oh no, he hangs on. Beautiful technique. Darth Vader fighting back in as Iron Man takes it to Groot. He's in trouble. What's Darth he's Vader thinking? Uh oh, he's got a force choke on Pooh. Here comes Maui. Here he comes. Oh! What a nasty force choke. Maui is here. Like what can he say except you're welcome? Going here tonight. I'm shocked he's even still in there, guys. Given the punishment he's taken, I figured somebody would have eliminated him by now. Well, uh oh. Yeah. Iron Man's over there celebrating, so but he's gonna go back over to Maui. I'm sure there's plenty of fight still left in I actually thought Maui would run in here and just immediately be 
slamming people like crazy as Pooh just destroys Groot. Oh, and now he's going to fight back with Vader. Baymax is coming. Oh, Groot takes out Iron Man. It's really cool to see Baymax here because Big Hero 6 was actually my favorite Disney movie. It is so awesome. It's hilarious. Here we go, guys. Elimination coming up. Baymax trying to take out Groot. It's actually surprising, but uh, Pooh is and gets out actually fighting. Oh boy, that could have been bad, Michael. Boom! He stumbled. A striking blow. Darth Vader's just kind of taking a nap. On, he dodges out of the way. Looks like we might get an The Beast guys. comes in at number Here 10. Comes, we are a third fellas. of the way through the, the competitors in this effort. Disney Royal Rumble. This is what and I think the Beast the could business. just lay some people out. What a strike. This might be it. Oh, my. Goes oh. for Baymax. Oh, He's starting to stumble here. He came into this He's going to try to take out Baymax. That's exactly what he's getting. The 2014 Royal Rumble match has so many rivalries, debuts, and streaks all in one. Here comes the workhorse, guys. History tells us... Darth Vader's got... Oh! Who just saved Maui there? Because I think Darth Vader might have been able to throw him out. Over it, guys. And now Maui's going to take it back to Darth Vader as Wreck-It Ralph comes in at number 11. This changes the entire... Oh, who just took out Baymax? With an exclamation point, no less. Who's actually making some noise? I gotta say, I underestimated him. Talk about a great escape. Ralph thought he was gonna wreck Groot, but Groot actually wrecked him. Looking for the finish. Maui going toe to toe with Darth Vader. What a strike! The beast is just manhandling Pooh. Shoulder right to the midsection. Aladdin comes in at number 12. He may very well be running on instinct right now. The 2017 Royal Rumble saw more. I haven't actually seen the new Aladdin movie yet. Usually, people that I know who have seen it says it's really good, but just about any reviews I've seen say it's kind of bad. Notice the amount of WWE superstars. Aladdin's actually taken a long time to get down here. He must not have brought his magic carpet. Lightning fast reflexes. Just straight for Groot. Looks like the beast was just taking a moment to celebrate. Aladdin trying to take out Groot. But Groot lives to fight another day. Maui and Darth Vader are still. Oh! Oh man. Yeah, he's definitely starting to Now he's trying to intimidate anybody that stands in his way. He's making a statement here with this attack. Goes after Pooh now. Looks to make an elimination here. Ralph is going up to the top. I wouldn't get up there. Frozone's coming out number 13. Look at the look on his face. Oh yeah, he Oh! Oh! Ralph just got wrecked and he got slammed straight on Pooh. Poor Pooh. I don't know how much longer he's gonna last. That's what you call a bad landing. He's looking a little off balance. He came into this match looking for a fight. Frozone and tries to go after Maui, but Maui's just going to teach him who's boss. Is he, is he going to get eliminated already? He's going to hang on. He's starting to stagger a bit. Well, he knew this was Seven guys in the ring. It could be anybody's yeah, game so far. Right We're still not halfway done yet, though, so it's a tall order for any of these guys. This is exactly the opening his opponent was looking for. It wasn't easy to find, but hey, he found it. Now he's showing his destructive power against Frozone. He simply needs to find Same thing for Pooh. Nice job getting out of trouble there. Talk about a great escape. Oh! Guys, a thunderous Samoa drop. Ever be ingrained in one of the most exclusive and elite lists of all the sports of the And now and Maui is, is looking to renew his, his rivalry with Darth Vader. Is he going to take him out? Oh, there goes Aladdin. And Darth Vader! Maui finished the job against Darth Vader. Looks like Ralph might be in trouble. Pooh's going to take a nap, give himself a little breather. 
You know, Byron's point about the elite list of past winners is spot on. Think about the now he's in trouble. Tried to add their name, but in the end, there's only that elite few. Yeah, that's right. That oh, Maui goes out. Ever. We're talking about the Undertaker. The Frozone finally getting himself some offense in against Wreck It Ralph. Boy, the time just flies, doesn't it? Oh! Who has taken so much punishment? Jack Sparrow is coming in at number 14. You're not kidding, Michael. Train for the elimination here. And gets out of harm's way. Who almost actually took out the beast there. He's making a statement here with this. Like I said, I underestimated Who, but no more. Okay, never mind. Who goes out? What took him so long? I'm not sure I'd want to be in the ring right now with the Beast and Ralph because there's some pretty heavy hitters. But it actually looks like... Oh! Oh! Wow! It actually looks like Frozone and Jack Sparrow are something to be a little bit scared of. Jack Sparrow. Is he going to be able to eliminate Frozone here? We are at the halfway mark. Number 15 is Captain Hook. Oh, boy. I wouldn't be surprised if Captain Hook and Captain Jack Sparrow went straight for each other. This could be it. What a chancery. He's looking a little weary here. Frozone not going to give us opportunity to see it. No. Jack Sparrow is gone. That was amazing. He has him right where he wants him. I was kind of looking forward to the two pirates to, well, slug it out. And there it is, boys. Frozone put a stop to that. He might take out this pirate, too. Beast is just destroying Ralph, it looks like. And now he goes straight to Captain Hook. Captain Hook is done. Here comes a Stormtrooper. He might be trying to avenge Darth Vader. There goes Frozone. He got wrecked. That was amazing. Well, a stormtrooper oh, came in and Nobody he missed. The of a like this guy. Okay, there you go. That one didn't miss. Okay, and then that one did miss. What is this stormtrooper doing? Captain Hook switched targets. Could be trouble here, guys. Who's next? Wow. The That's genie at number 17. The least. Maybe one of Aladdin's wishes was to, for the genie to come back in that here and actually win. Byron. Can fact, he actually win? Go straight for the stormtrooper. Attack to the midsection. I w didn't think it was possible, but it looks like the beast is kind of tired. Now he finally gets back up. Is he going to take out Captain Hook? He's looking banged up here, got knocked off his feet. He's not looking now good for Captain Hook. Down. He's not looking good. Oh! Looks like he just got choke slammed straight out of the ring. Mr. Incredible comes in at number 18. A little bit too late to meet his friend Frozone, but you know what? I still think he's got a good chance. Oh, and the Stormtrooper just powerbombed the genie out onto the floor. The genie is eliminated now. We're down to four in the ring, but we still have plenty of competitors to come. And there goes Stormtrooper. Ralph is ready to continue the wreckage. Mr. Incredible is fighting back. Oh, Darth Maul is out here now. Okay. Want to be in the ring now, that's for sure. Oh. Wow. Go straight for the beast. It looked like Beast might have been a little bit hurt there. He's probably exhausted by now. Might as well take the opportunity while you can get it. Not where he wants Looks to like be they right both now. have a good idea. And oh! Darth Maul comes in and eliminates so Beast almost immediately. Oh! Wow! Darth Maul's able to show his strength, and Tigger is out here at number 20. 
There he is. What a strike. He's not bouncing yet. Right the jaw. Oh, what but fight. he's going for Ralph, who's been That's in here the awesome. longest. So he's probably got the best oh, chance. Right. Oh! He's probably got the best chance against him. I will not celebrate too soon, though. Darth Maul on fire, though. I don't think Mr. Incredible was too excited to take any more punishment. Buzz Lightyear, number 21, to infinity and beyond. Buzz Lightyear is here. At the very same time that the competition Feels me, I'd probably start shooting those lasers. Coincidence? I think not. Buzz Lightyear plants Dark Maul. Looked like Dark Maul had been dominating up to then. We got another person coming in. It's going to be Mickey Mouse. Probably one of, if not the most recognizable character. I mean, who does not know Mickey Mouse? Looks like Buzz Lightyear knows who Mickey Mouse is now. Just immediately took him out. There goes Darth Maul. Mr. Incredible took out Darth Maul. That might have been a blessing there because if Darth Maul would have been in the ring much longer, he'd probably still been dominating. Who's out next? The Hulk. Oh, boy. If anybody can finally take out Ralph or Mr. Incredible, it's going to be Hulk. Go straight for Tigger. Tigger's actually fighting back. No way is Tigger going to take out the Hulk. He's still fighting back. I think Ralph's almost had enough. He's he's not up yet. Will he get back up? Hulk is just destroying Tigger. Man, Goofy! I mentioned that Big Hero 6 was probably my favorite movie, Disney movie. But I'd probably have to say Goofy is probably my favorite character. Goofy is just amazing. And there he goes. Oh, Goofy took out wreck it Ralph right after the Hulk smashed. Too bad for Tigger. He was on the receiving end of that. Mr. Incredible's trying to take out Mickey Mouse. Right to the spine. Wow! Goofy just... <laughs> he, okay, Goofy has come to fight. Oh, man, he's taking everybody out. Mr. Incredible is the only one he hasn't planted yet. Number 25 is Thor. Okay, we have an Avenger in the ring. I guess technically there's going to be two Avengers in the ring. Goofy. As much as I love Goofy, I don't know that he can take out the Hulk. Nope. Hulk has something to say about that. Buzz Lightyear avoids elimination as Mickey Mouse gets in trouble. Is Mickey Mouse going already? Yes, he is. Oh, and there goes the Hulk and Buzz Lightyear. Okay. We're down to Goofy, Mr. Incredible, and Thor. It could be anybody's game from here. It looks like Goofy. <laughs> Goofy's setting up for something, maybe. Mr. Incredible is just demolishing Thor. And then he goes right after Goofy. Now Goofy's in trouble. He's going to hang on. Oh, he's still in trouble. Okay, he fights free, gets back in the ring. Mr. Incredible, turn around. Oh! Star-Lord is up next at number 26. 
And if you were playing with your action figures at home, like Byron, time stood still when Goldberg stood before the almighty Undertaker. It didn't take long for Star Lord to just get pummeled. Nice job getting out of trouble there. Goofy oh, is not Goldberg. stopping. Oh boy, he is rolling. Harsh impact. Man, I'd run away from Goofy right now. Thor's fighting back on Mr. Incredible. Here's 27. Statistically speaking, the best position to draw. Uh oh, Star Lord. Star Lord's gone. He didn't last very long. Captain America is in at number 27. Definitely have him on my short list of favorites. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He's not looking good here. Oh, this may very well be one of his toughest challenges in a very long time. Credit, Captain America goes straight after Mr. So Incredible. Exactly and he looks to eliminate him already. Like as Goofy this continues man. his destruction. Here's a chance to win this. The ultimate oh, power of Goofy. Wow. Here we go. Oh, oh he took out Thor. I was seriously run away from Goofy. Oh, man. Stitch is out at number 28. Oh, and he can definitely Goofy. Make a here, guys. Without a doubt. He's looking banged up here, guys. And Did somebody like give Goofy the Infinity Gauntlet or something? He gets it with a reversal. And Stitch is just immediately getting just absolutely and wrecked by way. Captain America. Oh, boy, that could have been bad, Michael. Is Stitch gone already? I thought Mr. Incredible was coming to help. Finally, somebody puts Goofy in his place. Oh, wow, what a punch. Peter Pan, number 29. Wow, what a kick. Okay, Mr. Incredible sure is. Kicking butt and taking names. A bit more on Pat Patterson Man, poor Stitch has been getting destroyed. Oh, he actually hung on. <laughs> Peter Pan's already getting whooped by Captain America. On paper, that's a tough sell. But when it comes to Patterson, you have to trust that he knows. It's Stitch. I I okay, I was about to say, is he going to do the unthinkable and eliminate Mr. Incredible? Stitch trying to fight back. The last competitor is Spider-Man. He's just as capable as any of winning this thing and going on to WrestleMania. I can tell you with all. We are down to six competitors. The last six. It is anybody's game from here. Peter Pan is looking to take out Goofy as poor, poor, poor Stitch is still getting absolutely obliterated. Oh, I didn't even see Goofy go out. I was kind of focused on Stitch just getting pummeled. Stitch is trying his best to hang on. Peter Pan's just actually just going to hang out and... Oh! He was waiting for an opportunity to strike and he took it. element of surprise, it seems each year I find myself shocked at some of the names we see competing and just in the absolutely kind of plant stitch you, oh spider-man went to take out captain america but lowered the ropes Byron, I'm and well captain america's still here when this guy's on look out we're down to the final four. Oh, <laughs> man that was so that was actually kind of funny captain america went for that punch and Mr. Incredible is just like, uh, no, no, sir. What are you thinking? Not today. Ooh, what impact. Okay, Stitch. What a shot. Stitch looks like he hurt himself. He's looking at it. Oh! This one's over. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Peter Pan and Try Captain America going at it. Here. Stitch is trying his hardest to fight back. Oh, whoa! The Stitch! Oh! So where did Stitch get that power? Follow up here. Dodges trouble there. You got that right, Michael. That had elimination written all over it. Oh boy, he is rolling. Is Stitch actually going to take out Mr. Incredible? There's no way. There's no way. I knew it was only a matter of time. Yeah, you don't see a Looks like Captain America is getting the upper hand on Peter Pan. Mr. Incredible is not going to get eliminated. 
bitch. How are you still alive? Jeez, I I'm so sorry, here. buddy. He's making a statement here with this attack. Somebody just needs to throw him out and put him out of his misery already. Shoot, He's gonna die in there. Okay. Uh oh. Right hey, oh, I thought Captain America was a goner. Oh no. Okay, Mr. Incredible. Oh! <laughs> Stitch is barely alive, clinging on to life. Oh! Peter Pan. Okay. Now Captain America is beating Stitch down. Uh oh. What's Mr. Incredible thinking? Oh! Peter Pan just ate a nasty choke slam. Oh, and he reverses it. That could have been disastrous, Byron. Stitch again was trying his hardest to do any form of offense. Uh oh. Uh oh. Peter Pan. Oh! Mr. Incredible is out. Looks like we're going to get a replay. It's probably good for everybody that Mr. Incredible got out of that. Because if you ask me, he was probably on his way to victory. Oh boy, he is rolling. This could end it in a hurry. Oh man. That's what he was looking for, Michael. He's Look at Stitch's lifeless body. Barely moving. There is no way Stitch wins this. Oh man. Here's his moment, Michael. Uh, yeah, there's no way this match isn't over. Is Stitch going to take out Peter Pan? Oh, what an uppercut. Or actually, excuse me, I meant to say Peter Pan going to take out Stitch. There's no way Stitch is going to do anything but fly over the top rope. Harsh impact. Beautiful technique. Captain America is going after Peter Pan. I actually think it's okay to just completely ignore Stitch right now. Remember, both feet must touch the floor once in order to be eliminated from this Royal Rumble match. Peter Pan fighting back. He's looking to eliminate Captain America. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply if I was Stitch, I would help. Look out, a possible elimination. They are going to help. Is oh, Captain America done won. for? He's gone! Okay, it's down to Peter Pan and Stitch. With as much punishment as Stitch has taken, is there any chance that he could win? But <laughs> Peter Pan is capitalizing on this opportunity. Stitch is going to try his absolute hardest. It looks like he's actually doing something. Can Stitch do the unthinkable? Looks like they're both exhausted. Somehow, some way, Stitch is still in this. Looks like Peter Pan might be derailing that train. Oh, he hung on! I thought that was it. But ladies and gentlemen, Stitch is still here. Trying to fight back on Peter Pan. Don't hesitate, you gotta go. He's taking too much time here. Oh, he's able to reverse it. Who's it going to be? It up. Nice neck breaker. Is this it? Peter Pan? Uh oh. Oh, Is Stitch like finally gone? Yeah. Peter Pan the wins the oh, Disney goes. Royal Rumble. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Peter Pan has won the Disney Royal Rumble, and he is going on to take one of the last two spots. So now there's going to be one more Royal Rumble. There's one more spot to fill in the Royal Rumble tournament. Stay tuned for the next episode as we find out who takes the last spot in the Royal Rumble tournament. If you enjoyed what you saw, give that like button a nice big karate chop. Subscribe if you haven't already, and stay tuned. There's one more spot to fill.